a really successful day fishing. So I'm going to show you how to prep speckled trout fillets the day you fillet them so you can have a quick, clean meal, no mess. So this is how I prep big speck fillets for cooking in the future. Uh, excellent way to do it. It basically turns them into a boiling bag and you can season them however you want. So the only ingredients we need to do this dish are a little bit of green onion, a lemon, some butter, some fresh speck fillets and some Tony Sachery's Creole seasoning or whatever you like. Salt, pepper. My son really likes an adobo seasoning with a lot of garlic. Garlic, salt, whatever flavor you like. It's uh, to your personal preference. We'll slice the lemon, chop the green onions and slice some butter pads to put in with the dish. So it doesn't take much prep either. So this is how easy this dish is. Once I got my ingredients cut, lemons, green onions, and butter cut into pads, I simply pat dry my fish. So this is just to ensure that the bag gets a good seal. Try to take most of the moisture off of them. And once they're pat dry, I season them with a little Tony's or whatever you like, like I said, to your taste. Season the other side. And once we get our fish seasoned, it's this simple. Take a, a vacuum seal bag and I put a good size portion in a bag. So like two fillets for one person. I'll put a lemon slice right in the middle. Pat of butter on each side. Sprinkle a little bit of green onions on there. And then we just vacuum seal it. So I take and freeze them just like this. They're labeled specks. You got two fillets cleaned, seasoned. You got uh, a little lemon slice and some butter and all you do is drop them in a pot of boiling water and you got a fantastic meal. Quick, easy. You only deal with cleaning the fish once. You don't have a big mess later and it makes a one pot deal. Just take it out and drop it in some boiling water. So if you end up catching some really, really monster specks or like a 16 to 20 inch redfish, this is an excellent way to do redfish also. But here's two really big speck fillets I got. And all I'll do is just take and cut them in half and do the same thing. Season them up. This right here was actually a three and a half pound speck. This will make some beautiful, beautiful packets. Like I said, any type of seasoning you like. Salt, pepper, garlic powder, garlic salt, onion powder. So, whatever, however you like to prep them up. So we'll put our large speck fillet in there. Our lemon slice, some butter, some green onion, seal her up. See, that's with that big speck fillet. Boy, they're making me hungry. <laughs> Then once you got them packaged, it's easy for to take out just a bowl to make a meal. But like if you want to make some quick fish tacos, you just boil that. Have your little salsa and some shells and you got a, a quick easy dinner for the evening. So quick way, once you, once you fillet your specks, you'll have them totally cleaned and prepped for the next meal. And there's no mess the second time. Everything's contained. Boil them in a pot of water. One pot meal, easy to do. 
So the beauty of this technique is you can take your fish right out the freezer frozen. You don't even have to thaw it out and drop it right in your pan or pot of boiling water. Simmer in water, simmer it about 10 minutes and it'll, it'll be done perfectly. So sous vide, boiling bag, whatever you want to call it. All we'll do is we'll take it out, we'll cut our bag with some scissors and it'll be a nice easy to prepare meal, clean, quick and simple. So you can see right here we got a light simmer. It's been going for about five minutes. Some of the butter's melting. The fish is getting opaque on the back side. And all we'll do is take and we'll flip her over. So you can see she's pretty much cooked on this side. And we'll give it about five minutes on the on the other side now. Alright, so once your timer goes off. Turn your timer off, turn your stove off, and you can see it's done, it's ready. So I'll let it drip a second. Dry the outside of the bag off a little. Cut it open, and here's our dish. So here's our dish, speckled trout boiling bag, and you can see it's cooked perfectly, flaking apart. So you could serve this with a vegetable, a salad, uh, however you want to do it. Today, I happen to have a buttered biscuit. So speckled trout and biscuits. So this is a super easy dish to prepare. And it's delicious. So once you uh, do your initial fish cleaning and all, you never have to fool with it at all again. When the water cools down in the pan, I'll dump it out, wipe it out with a dry paper towel. The cleanup's easy and the meal's delicious. So until the next video, eat some fish.